And um, yeah, I mean, it's it's really it's really cool because I I got a uh, my last one was five months ago, but I mean, do you think you can cause your own seizures? Because I don't, but I don't know. <laughs> and, and I think I fucked up on this one because I got an email from some guys and they were like, hey, you know, we represent people that like, like make one of your meds and we were wondering if you come in and do, do a testimony, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, okay, sure. And it ended up being like a whole weekend thing. We actually came to Denver and it was all everybody sharing their stories and everything. Like basically if you put a room of CP people in, you're just gonna hear patients and, and uh, parents being like, yeah, we went to all this physical therapy and the kids said us names, but seizures are weird because everything's daily for some people and some people they go months and it's like, okay, now we're through the whole thing about like the job loss is one thing. And then you have the dating, that's really fun because I remember this one time uh, I was gonna go out with this woman and then I, what I did is I sent her a, a seizure first aid thing. She was like, yeah, I, I can't, I can't do this. But my other friend can, so he can. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing though, it's really weird because after seizures, I'm horny as fuck. I, I will fucking, <laughs> as long as they understand that they cannot blow me because I have chronic pain shots in my shaft. <laughs> And that is an extremely odd conversation to have. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, doesn't matter if it's a man or a woman. I'm like, what are we gonna do here? Uh, we'll do cam sex over Zoom. <laughs> <laughs>